hello lolers welcome back to my channel i miss you guys so much if you're new to the channel what's up welcome my name is kalia make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as that like button y'all already know the drill okay because you're gonna end up subscribing anyway i mean how could you not this is where all the cool people be okay so yeah make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the gang all right don't hate me i know i haven't posted a video in forever actually the month of july I have not been consistent with posting videos at all and I'm already like not the most consistent person but I've been trying to work on it but July has been crazy you guys my boyfriend he graduated college and it was his birthday I was helping him celebrate his birthday then the patch broke the game so I wasn't even able to open my game for the longest time y'all it took me like three days to fix my game because the patch broke my game if you're watching this and you still can't open up your game make sure you check your mods folder okay you probably have a mod that's outdated because that's what happened to me the mod that didn't work for me was the skateboarding and scooter mod if you have that mod in your folder right now you need to delete it because your game is not going to open but that was the problem in my game so hopefully if you have the same problem hopefully it helped you out and also you guys make sure you turn auto updates off in origin because a lot of people lose their progress in their game because they update the game with their mods still in the mods folder and you can break your game entirely if you update your game without taking your mods folder out okay so make sure you do that so yeah as you guys know cottage living just came out i'm excited to play it but not because like i've always wanted to farm i don't like going outside milking cows sounds terrible to me in fact, I milked a cow before in elementary school and I almost cried because it was nasty. I'm excited to play the game and complain because I love complaining. It's like if complaining was an Olympic sport, I would have won gold for the USA like year after year. Today we are going to make my cottage living sims. I already know what storyline I kind of want to go with. So yeah, today we're going to make our sims. But before we get this video started, if you do not have cottage living yet and you want it, make sure you head on over to instant gaming if you do not use instant gaming by now you are missing out because instant gaming has the sims 4 and the expansion packs at a discounted price cottage living was 40 dollars when it came out i only paid 30 dollars for it that's 10 dollars off and the game just came out okay so make sure you head over to instant gaming for all your sims for needs the link is right there in the description for your convenience so make sure you head on over and start saving some money today but okay now that we got that over with let us start our sims okay i'm really excited y'all i actually missed the sims 4 i know who would have thought that would be coming out of my mouth like a nice little week away from the sims i'd be missing it because the sims is my life actually hold on you guys i'm looking for a hairstyle so we can see her face i always do this and make sure you follow me on twitch because i make a lot of my sims on twitch so a lot of my sims that are in my let's plays i Make them on Twitch and I stream and I talk to you guys. So if you haven't already, make sure you follow me on Twitch. This is a nice hairstyle so we can see her face. And this hair is by Brandy Sims, by the way. So make sure you go get it if you don't have it already. But let's get this started, okay? We're gonna take this wacky tacky ass makeup off. And my inspiration for this Let's Play is actually the Disney Channel movie cowbells y'all youngins probably don't know nothing about cowbells okay Allie and aj were the stars of it if you do not know who Allie and aj is sweetie you too young <laughs> not me sounding like a fossil the story is that they're two spoiled ass girls and their dad owns a dairy plant kind of whatever it's called okay and they do not know what it means to work for anything so they're always in some shit they basically just get into a whole bunch of trouble because they don't know anything and their dad forces them to work at the dairy plant so it's a good movie it's on disney plus if you have not seen it already yeah that's the inspiration for this let's play so uh, we're gonna make like two spoiled ass girls and instead of working at a dairy plant because i don't think we can do that i want them to like move with their grandma so we're gonna probably make their grandma 
We're going to have them work on a farm and they're going to know what it means to finally work for something, okay? <laughs> yeah, right now I'm just getting her cute. Now we need a skin. I think when I'm done with her, I'm probably just going to make a twin. Ooh, I've never used this skin by Kiko. Ooh, oh. Now, okay, why does she look like that from the side? Uh, like, not her catfish and us. No, because it was giving monkey. Uh, Y'all, I'm really stuck on if I'm going to make them twins or not. Or if one should be older. One could be a young adult and then one could be a teenager. But then if you're a young adult, your parents can't really send you away to your grandma's. You feel me? I wish my dad would try to send me away. I'm a grown-ass woman. I would run away. I'm leaving. And I would leave through the front door too. Like, you're not about to keep me on no farm isn't there like a hates outdoors trait yeah we'll probably give them that oh and the squeamish trait yes she really looks like nikki oh my god no this skin eats though this skin is by kiko vanity no it's really the nose it's the nose especially from the side that's giving me nikki all right let's find some lashes for her and i just realized that i wasn't recording with my sound on so now the girls have to find some music to put over this video. <laughs> we need some falsies. Her face is kind of throwing me off. Like, she's pretty, but I'm kind of thrown off. It's because her head is little. Oh, and her forehead is big. Oh, you know what it is? Her face is all the way down. Yes! Okay. I never just make cast videos. I always stream, but people have been asking me for cast videos. So I said, let me just try it out. But I need you guys' help. I need you guys input. I need you guys opinion. I need it right now. We got the bootleg Onika. They'd be like, yeah, I want to see Nikki in concert. Her family be like, we got Nikki at home. Let's change her body real quick. Let me put something on her so I can see. Like, I always just put a swimsuit on them or something so we can see what we're working with. And right now it's giving string bean. And y'all, I'm gassy because I drank some iced coffee. I keep farting maybe it's a good thing i'm not streaming i have like a couple of favorite body presets like i like this one i think this is by melanin simmer actually yeah let's go with this one i like this one this is cute for for we don't even need to do much tweaking she actually looks perfect i don't even know what i'm gonna put on them because i tried looking for farming cc and it was just ugly it was treacherous my eyes were bleeding it was giving unseasoned I wanted some cowgirl boots and I couldn't find any. All I have are hoe clothes and that's all I like. I guess we're going to be some hoes on the farm. And you know what? We stand. No, her jaw too strong. Look at her jaw. Why I look like she clenching her teeth? Y'all know how guys be clenching their teeth to make it seem like they got a jawline? Guys be catfishing. They be talking about us. Boy, unclench your jaw. Let's see how you really look. I don't know what we gonna put on. It's kind of gonna be Nicole in Paris. What's that show? The Simple Life? That's what we're kind of giving. We're gonna have parties in the barn while our grandmother's asleep. And it's just gonna be a fun old time. Can somebody make some hoe farming clothes? Ugh. Just cause we're farming, do we have to dress ugly? We can be cute and farm. Wait, you guys, let's see what clothes came with Cottage Living so we can have an idea of, you know, what we should wear because I have no idea. Oh, this, these clothes are ugly. Is it a crime to be hot? Is that what they're telling us? It's really a crime to be hot, according to The Sims Cottage Living. This is a hospital gown. <sighs> Absolutely not. No, you know what's crazy? People do not play with CC. There are some people who just be raw dogging The Sims. No mods, no CC. And it's like, you don't have to live like that. You really don't. I've decided actually they're gonna come in matching sweatsuits, right? That's how they're gonna arrive on the farm. And we're going to give them a cute little Louis purse. You know, it's really going to be like Nicole and Paris and the whole simple life shebang or whatever. And then when we really start the LP up, then we'll change them into some farmer girl chic because y'all, I'm going to stay here all day looking for something to put on these girls. This sweatsuit is by Kiko Vanity. It's old though. So you should have it already. If you follow my CC Finds blog, then you probably have it. If you don't follow my CC blog yet, follow me right now. 
because y'all keep asking where I get my CC from. And I have a whole Tumblr blog just for you guys to go through and pick what you want and download it. All in one place, okay? We're going to put these Fendi slides on her. We're going to um, give her sister some other slides. We're going to give us a nice little set. And of course, we need a bag. We need something like this or this. Oh, no. Oh, and we need some ice on us. And then while she's milking the cow, her rings fall in the bucket. And she's just like, oh, my God, my rings, my jewelry. And her grandma is like, there's people dying, Kim. I was looking for this purse, but I want like a bigger purse. Y'all know exactly what purse I'm talking about. The purse that was floating, but in this pattern. And I thought I had one, but I guess I don't have one. I guess I was making shit up because I'm delusional. Oh, yeah, we need a necklace oh maybe we should give them glasses that's so bougie they pull up like you know hold on wait hold on this how they gonna pull up to the farm we pulling up to the farm like this or whatever girl we need obnoxious jewelry oh this hair is pretty Okay, Brandy Sims. Wait, I really like this hair. We might have to put this on him. Ooh, this hair is cute too. Uh, yeah, we gonna put this hairstyle on her. She came with the fresh wig to the farm. and So one sister down, time to do the other. Oh my God, I just spent all this time making one Sim. I'm screaming. Okay, now I kind of already know what I want to do. I'm gonna make her twin real quick and then we gonna be right back. To be honest, this is not my best work and cast but i told you i haven't even played the game in forever so obviously i need to step my cast game back up like i need to just come in here do some drills i would have gave them a duffel to make it look like you know they just arrived but then y'all know how the sims be looking when you give them a purse in game like they just be waving it around like they about to smack the shit out of somebody I'm missing The Sims 2 when you can hit people with your purse. I don't think you could do that. I think Miss Miss Crumplebottom did that. And now she's back in the game. No, because if Miss Crumplebottom tried me, I'm going to beat her ass. I'm not even playing with her in The Sims 4. In The Sims 2 and 3, she was just an old lady. Now, I don't care if you old. You getting your shit rocked, Miss Crumplebottom. Don't even play those games with me. I'm not the one. We respecting all old people except Miss Crumplebottom. We going to jump her ass. Oh, this is cute. Yeah, I like this. This is cute. And she needs some jewelry too. And then after this, we're going to make the grandma. I saved the best for last because the grandma is going to be so fun to make. Okay. Looking cute, girls. So let's give them names. Like I said, this is based off of cowbells. So I'm just going to give them the names of the girls in cowbells. So we're going to name her Courtney. Their last name is McCallum in the movie. So name her Courtney McCallum. And her sister is named Taylor McCallum. Let's give them their traits real quick. And then we go move on to their grandma. Okay, I'm going to give her squeamish. I can't find hates outdoors. I don't even know if that's a trait. I think I've been playing too much Sims 3. Because I think that's a Sims 3 trait. I don't think it's a Sims 4 one. Yeah, I don't know. We're just going to give them some generic aspirations until I get all my mods back because I do not have all my mods back in my game right now. So I'm kind of limited with my traits and aspirations and just mods in general, but we can fix that. This is just temporary. So we got Courtney McCallum and she is materialistic and squeamish. And we got her sister, Taylor McCallum. And she is squeamish and a snob. So we're going to have some fun. And what's the world called? Henford on Bagel. Henford on Bagley. Sorry. So yeah, let's make their grandma, shall we? All right, y'all. So we got grandma over here. Well, for now, that's how she looks. And so they grandma, she rough and tough. Okay, that's why they daddy sent them to stay with they grandmother because she don't play but i actually want her to be a stud she be smoking weed she got some weed plants in the back she be chewing tobacco she used to cat call men back in her day to make them uncomfortable like she's a queen i don't know whenever you think of grandmas 
you think of a girly old lady who just sits down and knits and just cooks all day, just docile. But they grandma, she done killed some folks back in her day, okay? She a gangster. Their grandma, she not playing with them when they pull up. But she kind of reminds me of my grandma because my grandma be on the go. I didn't see my grandma carry a stack of bricks. My grandma, she be building shit. She be outside. She be hammering shit. She don't need no man to help her do nothing. So that's what they grandma on to. Their grandma don't need no help from nobody. And that's on period. And I hate using skins on the elders because you can never see their age when you put a skin on them. Look at this, y'all. We might just have to let her rock because I still want her to look like a grandma. But it's okay, we have face masks. So we can give her face a little more dimension. Yeah exactly not grandma and miss crumple bottom about having an affair <sighs> what's wrong with me <laughs> yes wait because why they grandma pretty <laughs> she's cute oh y'all because why grandma baddie okay me mom hold on y'all i'm fixing grandma body she's fit because she be outside farming all day Okay, y'all, I gave grandma some tats. I told y'all she used to be out here. I think this says respect. She got respect tatted under her titties. And I have some overalls I want to put on her already. I hope they're in the game. Found them. And these are by Boosra TSR, by the way. Boosra makes amazing Sims CC. Like, y'all should have Boosra stuff if y'all don't already. I think I just butchered sis's name, but I'm sorry, I didn't mean it, okay? Hold on, let's give her some shoes. Man, I wish we had cowboy boots. <sighs> no, you know what I wanna put on her? <laughs> oh yeah, these Tims. Yes, these Tims, these the one, these the one. No, I'm gonna put the yellow on, and then we'll change like the color she has on. We'll just put the red on her. <gasps> Can she stop smiling like that? Her smile is scary, I'm sorry. And now a hairstyle. I don't know. I think this is like the hardest part. So we can go with a lot of hairstyles. We can go with this one. Well, no. Okay. We're going to use this one because I never use this hairstyle and she actually looks good with it. <laughs> she got her hair pressed. We're going to give her like a whole bunch of ear piercings. Yeah. Like these. Okay, Graham. Let's give her some traits. I'm about to give her the stud trait because it's by Mother Simmer. And I've never played with it before, but I want to see what it entails of. So we're going to give her the stud trait. Oh, we're going to give her handy. And I want to try the farmer trait. These Sims live on a farm, loves to grow food, fish by the water, and take care of animals. They also learn gardening and fishing faster than others. I'm not sure if this came with cottage living or if this is a mod I had, but we're going to use this. We're going to give her the country caretaker. I think this is new. Country caretakers want to tend the countryside and befriend all animals and critters. So we're going to give her this. And uh, let's give her a name real quick. We're going to name her Tammy. So we got Tammy McCallum, the head lady of the house or farm or cottage. And she is a stud. She's handy. And she's a farmer. We got Courtney McCallum. And uh, she is materialistic and squeamish. And we got Miss Taylor McCallum, and she is squeamish and a snob. So these are our sims for our new cottage living let's play. And I'm calling my let's play Cowbells. And I actually started a new save file. So we finally got a new save file. Y'all know I've never played on a new save file. Ever since I started my channel, I played on the same save file. It's been like two years now, two and a half years almost. And yeah, we're starting fresh. I'm really excited. I'm actually about to find a farm for them on the gallery. And I will start recording episode one right after this one. Literally, after I finish this video, I'm gonna start it. Yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned, okay? Let me know what you guys want to see from the girls in this let's play we about to have like barnyard parties i don't know we're gonna be stealing our grandma's weed i don't know we just gonna be doing shit okay so yeah let me know what you want to see i hope you guys enjoyed cc details are in the description make sure you follow me on twitter instagram and twitch at lol kalia and i will see you guys with the first episode of our cottage living lp called 
cowbells i love you guys and thank you so much for your patience and understanding and your support you guys are the best i love you guys i will see you guys sooner than soon bye